All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash. Yahweh is the name of the Heavenly Father, and Yahweh Shai's name is the only begotten Son, who the world ignorantly know of Jesus Christ. And I want to give double honors to all the elders and apostles, the great millstone, how I learned the truth from. And I want to say Shalom to the whole elect. May the most I bless you with his gracious mercies. You know, today, this letter, you know, going to be titled, you know, um, set our affections on things above, man. We got a lot to look forward to, man. You know, first and foremost, we got, uh, you know, our Lord and Savior to look forward to. Yahweh Shah Mashiach, man, the return of him. You know, coming back in his glory, man, to take over his righteous kingdom, man. And, you know, we put everything in order, man. You know, we'll be able to get true rest, man. I'm going uh, to start right here. Colossians 3 and 1. If ye then be risen with Hamashiach, seek those things which are above where Hamashiach sitteth on the right hand of the Most High. Set your affection on things above, not on things on the earth. You know, that's what we're doing, man. We're setting our affection on things above, man. The kingdom, man. You know. That's, that's, man, that's gonna be one of the, man, that's, man, that's beautiful. You know, the kingdom to come, man. And how shall I come back slaughtering our enemies for us, avenging us, and himself, you feel me? That's, that's gonna be beautiful, man. You know, that's, that's number one, you know. And the kingdom and righteousness, man. Everything gonna be in righteousness, man. We will not go off no more, man. Ezekiel 11 and 19 and say and I will give them one heart and I will put a new spirit within you and I will take the stony heart out of their flesh and will give them an heart of flesh you see that they may walk in my statues and keep my ordinance and do them and they shall be my people and I will be their God Man, so the Lord going to give us, man, a heart of flesh, man. It's the, the law, statutes, and commandments just going to be in us, man, naturally, man. We going we gonna to be able to, to live in harmony, man. Everybody, man, going to get along, man. It ain't going to be no wicked-ass niggas out here no more, man. Man, our nation is going to be perfect, man. That's what we're looking forward to, man. Perfect kingdom, man. Our Lord and Savior running everything, you know. You be able to let your kids go out and just roam freely. You ain't gotta be worried about somebody snatching your fucking kids up or eating GMO foods or none of that shit, man. It's, man. Man, it's gonna be beautiful, man. You know? Man. Let me get this real quick. So, like. Foods, no more loud ass cars, man. Like these niggas be riding past camp, stomping a motor, just man. No more of that, man. Everything gonna be in righteousness. From Ezekiel 37 and 25. And they shall dwell in the land that I have given unto Jacob, my servant, wherein your fathers have dwelt. And they shall dwell therein, even they and their children and their children's children forever. And my servant David shall be their prince forever. Man, this is going to be beautiful, man. Hmm. We're going to be back in our land. We ain't got to worry about it. Man, no more, no more wickedness, man. Uh, Ezekiel 37, 26. Moreover, I will make a covenant of peace with them. It shall be an everlasting covenant with them 
and I will place them and multiply them and will, and will set my sanctuary in the midst of them forevermore. My tabernacle also shall be with them. Yeah, I will be their God and they shall be my people. And the heathen shall know that I, Yahweh, do sanctify Israel when my sanctuary shall be in the midst of them forevermore. So, yeah, man, these heathens, they going to know, man. They going to be like, man, these, man, they are God's chosen people, man. And they been kicking us while we down, man, all this time, man. Lord said I was a little upset with Israel, man. But, you know, Esau helped forward our, our affliction, man. It's going to be, it's going to be beyond, man, beautiful. Especially when we get the whoop on Esau, man. Man, relentlessly. Like, Man, it's gonna be beautiful, man. You know. What is this here, man? It's a lot. Bear with me for a second. Sucking child shall play on the hole of the asp, and the winged child shall put his hand on the cockatrice den. When you go into these words, man, these are poisonous snakes, man. A venomous snake, man. Cobras, adders, vipers. This is what we got to look forward to, man. We're going to be able to really enjoy the animals, man. We ain't gonna have to be scared of animals no more, man. <laughs> I know myself, man. I don't, you know, there's a lot of animals I don't fuck with. It is say the sucking child shall play on the hole of the ass, man. So you, you talking about a, a, a baby, a crawling baby, no teeth baby, gonna be able to play with king cobras and man, that's what we got to look forward to, man. Cheers, man. We got we got chariots, man. We got chariots to look forward to, man. Everybody gonna have a chair over they over they place, man. <laughs> Got a lot to look forward to, man. You know, as long as we, you know, do what we need to do, man. Stay, stay humble. You know, stay in the spirit. You know, continue, continue on, man. Continue enduring, man. We got a lot to look forward to, man. It's a lot. Everybody gonna have their own chair, man. Let me 
it's gonna be better for the for the air too, man. No more goddamn polluted ass. You know, air, man. We're gonna be able to breathe fresh air, man. We got a lot to look forward to, man. Beautiful kingdom, man. Ran in righteousness, man. You know, like you just said, my kids gonna be able to play with poisonous snakes, man. You ain't gonna have to worry about where your kid at, man. Kid gonna be able to just go out and play, man. Play as much as he want, man. You ain't gotta worry about is they safe, is they being snatched up, or something wrong. Man, your neighbor gonna look out for your kids and righteousness. How it's really supposed to be going on now, man. It's gonna, man. It's gonna be a beautiful, a beautiful kingdom, man. <laughs> We have a beautiful kingdom to look forward to, man. Like, for real, man. And it's crazy, because Jake, Jake want to just continue here, man. Jake love it here, man. And that's just, that's just stupidity, man. That's, man. It's like... Isaiah 4 and 5. And the Lord Yahweh will create upon every dwelling place of Mount Zion and upon her assemblies a cloud and smoke by day and the shining of a flaming fire by night. For upon all the glory shall be a defense. So we're going to have cheers, man, over our house, man. This, man. <laughs> Everybody, it say upon every dwelling place of Mount Zion, man. We gonna have cheers, man. We got, man. We, man let me see. Isaiah 54 and 12 and I will make thy windows of a gates and thy gates of carbuncles and all thy borders of pleasant stones that's what we got to look forward to man a beautiful and a righteous kingdom man and then continuing on it say and all thy children shall be taught of you Howard, and great shall be the peace of thy children so it's going to be peace man and righteousness shall thou be established. Thou shalt be far from oppression, for thou shalt not fear, and from terror, for it shall not come near thee. So we ain't got to worry about being oppressed no more. We don't have to worry about fear. We don't have to worry about being just terrorized no more, man. It's going to be a beautiful and righteous kingdom, man. We're going to have roads, man, made out of gold, man. Revelations 21 and 21. And the 12 gates were 12 pearls. Every several gate was of one pearl. And the street of the city was pure gold. 
as it were transparent glass. Man, we got a lot to look forward to, man. Ooh, this is gonna be beautiful, man. Can you imagine roads made out of gold, man? You can't even imagine that, man. Look at this, man. All this bullshit ass concrete we got out here, man. Grass dying. Man, GMO foods. Stank outside. We ain't, man. We got a lot to look forward to, man. You know? I'm gonna end it. Um, I ain't trying to keep going on, man. We got a lot to look forward to, man. We just gotta endure to the end, man. And Lord willing, you know, we count it as his, his elect, man, so we can get up out of here. I'm gonna end it right here in Colossians 3 and 1 again. If ye then be risen with Hamashiach, seek those things which are above where Hamashiach sitteth on the right hand of the Most High. Set your affections on things above, not on things on the earth. Hey, man, I'm going to end it right there, man. Lord, what in this video was, you know, uplifting to your brothers and sisters. And with that, I'm going to say shalom.